What is happening in the trucking industry parallels what is happening in every single other industry. General Electric getting very aggressively involved in this world of connectivity and the Internet of Things is now buying more technology startups than Google. What is happening is a stunning acceleration of innovation in your industry. You know, think about the elements of autonomy which are coming together. We've already got collision avoidance technology. We've got pedestrian and object detection technology. We've got a spatial awareness in terms of what is happening around our trucks and GPS capabilities. We've got vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communications capability for lane distance time compression, these pelotons which are being rapidly implemented. We've got opportunities for remote vehicle control. We've got predictive fuel efficiency routing capabilities. We've got the emergence of intelligent highway technology, lane distance and time compression. We weren't talking about this at trucking conferences 10 years ago. We've got startups, folks who are literally working in their garages in San Francisco and Silicon Valley, working to define the trucks of the future. We've got these Peloton trials. Two years ago, they were science fiction. Today, they're real, and they're beginning to happen everywhere. We've got accelerated innovation. Do you see the announcement just a week ago from UPS that they are testing a truck which will have a drone in the top of the truck and will take a package and do that last mile delivery? We've got augmented reality coming in which we will have the ability to interact with packages and goods and logistics in new and different ways. We've got intelligent highway infrastructure. This isn't just about self-driving trucks. This is about the intelligent stuff we're putting in the roads and bridges and highways that interacts with our vehicles through connectivity. We've got bioengineered capabilities. You know, doing my research, I came across this fascinating article. They said for a lot of autonomous vehicles to work correctly, we've all got to be communicating amongst each other. All of these vehicles have to have the ability to, to, to uh, talk to each other. And one of the leading transportation companies, you know what they've done? They've gone out and they have hired an expert in penguins, an expert who understands penguin behavior, because the belief is that the way the penguins interact in a group of penguins will perhaps define the way a group of trucks will interact in communicating in this self-driving world. We are even talking about remote operation. A future in which perhaps, which Audi has been looking at, we can have a truck with no doors, no windows, no driver. Might take five years, might take 10 years, 50 years, 25 years, who knows. But with somebody, just as we do in the US military, flying a drone from thousands of miles away, taking out a bad hombre, someone driving a truck from a remote facility through connectivity. The future is coming at us with absolutely staggering speed. 